Ah, well here we are again. Follow me to Apex, my friends. Reaper Hunter 23 here. I just punched my computer stand. Welcoming you back to Let's Play Plants vs. Zombies. Oh boy. The last recording session I did of this was an absolute disaster piece. Fraps did this thing where all of my all of the game audio got desynced. So you were seeing like peas hit zombies and the noise happening like five it's 10 nanoseconds sooner than it should have. And it could get really tedious to witness after a while. So that's why the last video was only like 15, or not even like 13 minutes. And I lost all of World 3, basically. Which sucks, because that was my favorite set of levels, that of my favorite music, some of my favorite plants. Yeah. Anyway, let's get on with the show. You know they used to call me Fog Man, because I would hang out in the fog and jump out at people. Ah, those were the days. Didn't really have a lot to say there this time. Oh yeah, so, nighttime pool levels, basically, come with the addition of fog, because they hate you. Actually, I'm gonna forgo the cherry bombs for a doom shroom. Uh, tall nut? See the whole thing about. Okay, we definitely need pea shooters. Um, I don't know, puff shrooms maybe? No, I need some kind of defensive thing. What am I thinking? I'm gonna go with walnuts because it's nighttime, don't have a lot of. Yeah, you get what I'm saying. Can I plant in the fog? I don't remember. Whatever. Throw down the sunflower first. Yeah, I can throw them down wherever I need. Oh, I really should have done puff shrooms instead. I'm a silly goose. Brains. Oh yeah, this is gonna be bad. Alright, I'm just gonna restart the level. That was a mistake. Um, yeah, yeah, you just to jump out at people in the fog, we know. That was... I don't know what I was thinking. Okay, so... Tangle Kelp even. Walnuts, squash, and uh, doom shroom. That should be sufficient. Okay, alright. Off to a respectable start. Now that I actually have my uh, <clears throat> plants all situated. Hmm. See, if they cut. They, I'm pretty sure you can plant in the fog anyway. Like, yeah. You may not know when they're coming, and maybe I shouldn't have done that as an example when I could probably use another puff shroom on this row here, but you know. Yeah. <clears throat> I 
Oh no, that looks like a cone head. That's not good. Throw a walnut down, and throw you there. And I suppose we'll put the lily pad down. Throw you there. I couldn't see if they dropped like a. Uh... I'm gonna throw him back there. Oh, wait, I forget what he does. Oh, no. I, oh, that was a waste. I don't remember what the, uh, what's it does. The, uh, why am I? Jack in the box? Jack in the box. That's what I'm thinking of what that zombie does. Luckily they still take it easy on you for the first one, like I'm only just going to get... or we're only gonna have the one big wave here. I don't even think I'll... I probably won't even really need to, like, defensify myself all that much. Although I should probably start. No. Throw one of these down. Uh, start walnutting my, uh... Oh wait, huge wave of stuff. Man, I can't see where everything is, so I don't know where best to apply the Doom Shroom. Oh, I know. Okay. Mmm. I couldn't see it, but I know it was good. Alright. The uh, plants are in is kind of like the grave buster as far as how I use it in that I don't really use it very much more than the a little bit vivid to show it off and see what it's about here but that's just because I don't know uh, puff shroom uh, and I guess I still need a walnut I just let's see here planter and I feel like I can deal with the fog pretty easily anyway. Like being it not being able to see not the worst thing in the world. It can be handled. If this was si if this was Silent Hill, however, it would be a different story. But I will just throw one down here to show you what's up. I don't think he stays there forever either. Like, he eventually runs out. Oh god. Oh god. I sit here and stand corrected though. Oh, but it's not that it's not that hard to deal with. That guy should be able to finish him off, though. <laughs> yeah, we'll throw this other plantern right up there. Though. Should be able to kill it? No? Oh. I'm gonna put that right there. Put another one of you right there. I guess throw down the lantern. <laughs> Whoops. 
in all actuality, I probably should have put the plants there and maybe in the other- Oh, I did not mean to do that. It's a good thing that row is not in any, like, immediate danger. Have I just been being stupid about picking up my son? I wish I had some Tangle Kelp right now. Huh. I don't remember this being so, I don't know, rough before. Like, I remember being able to handle this pretty easily. Well, not easily, but... Like, this huge wave is probably gonna kill me. Would not be at all surprised. I guess we'll get our last sunflower down here. Oh god. They ate my other thing. Really tapping into that fear of the unknown here. It's a good thing I got one of these though. I think I just about handled that, uh... Yeah, I just about handled the, uh, huge wave there. <laughs> I hope. Alright, so bad bad juju is happening at the bottom of the screen. I can feel that much. I don't know how bad the juju is though. And that's what the problem is. When the, uh, when the walnut just emerges and is seeing some stuff there, that is, from the light there, that's an amusing visual, let me tell you. So I definitely need to replace, like, a walnut on each lane here. I think I'm gonna go with this one right here, though. Because I've still got, like, visibility there. Can I plant on that? No, not yet. Oh, he's too far past. Oh, I ruin everything. You see, the thing about this is, basically, because of puff shrooms and whatnot, it's like a zerg rush, almost. No, oh, of course I did that. Alright, I'm gonna protect him. Like, because of the zero- yeah, because of the zero sun and relatively quick respawn, or reset time of them, I can basically just zerg these zombies. Maybe I'm just too worried about everything dying being the problem when, really, as long as I keep them away from my yard, or my door, that's all that really matters, right? Throw down the, uh, little protective. Squash should be ready by the time that this guy, well, that guy should be dead, what am I saying? Mushroom. I'm just gonna throw another one of you right there. Huge wave. I'm gonna put a walnut right in front of my planter. Cut up. Oh. 
I actually don't have to put a wall in front of my planter because I made them all die. So now uh, I just need to choose how I'm gonna deal with. It. I'm just gonna squash him. I'm gonna squash. I'm gonna squash them. There are two zombies right there. Oh, I'm gonna need to use him. And he... all right, so cactus are cool because they're they work like pea shooters, and they have a double effect here because we got these jerks over here almost pointed it well I pointed for real anyway at the screen this balloon zombie not good no fun so let's see here cactus are nice because they give us a long range or a longer range thing to go with our uh, assortments of yeah I lost my train of thought again alright so 